Do you see the shirt? Uh, I love it. It's looking it's great. It looks great. TGRG. Especially, especially on camera. Yeah. No. Yeah. I bet it would look great in real life. People should order them. Yeah, I bet it looks <laughs> amazing. If you want them. I bet it would really compliment your figure. Yeah. Go to our website. Yeah. <laughs> Sizes are disappearing quickly, but you can order any size and we'll get them for you. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Um, so we'll do Would You Rather and then um, we can talk about whatever dumb shit you want to talk about in the next one. Yeah, that sounds great. Welcome to another episode of Two Guys with Raging Goals. I'm Mikey, and this is Adam. And every Friday, we bring you a conversational podcast where one of us brings a topic to the table, and we discuss it for your enjoyment. Okay. If you like that... <laughs> that was the best Instagram pic. Oh my god, I love it. Yeah, okay. oh my god. Oh, look, we look like psychopaths. That's great. <laughs> If you like that, you can follow us on Facebook, YouTube, Twitter, uh, patreon.com, slash two guys raging. Um, you can find us on any social media, two guys with raging goals. Um, you can also just search TGRG, that'll get you to us today. Yes. Today. Oh, I always forget this part. You can also find us on anywhere that podcasts are available. I always yeah. forget that this is a podcast. And yeah, not right. just, not, thing. Not like, just that. Yeah, but, we, yeah. yeah, we do have audio files that you can find us on as well. Oh, yeah. If you go to either twoguysraging.com, you can also go to iTunes or Google Play. You can find us anywhere except for, for uh, what's that one? Spotify. Spotify. Can't find us on Spotify yet. They're bastards. bastards. <laughs> yes. Perfect. Uh, end result there. Today. Yes. Adam. Yes. We're going to play Would You Rather. I was thinking about, like, what what topics do I want to discuss? And, like, there's a lot of shit going on right now that I oh, would yeah. like to talk about. However, it's all kind of fucking depressing. Like heavy. Yeah. Real heavy. Real, real heavy shit, right? Like Trump's taking over the yeah. galaxy. Yeah, and, yeah, the Comey yeah. thing. I don't want to talk yeah. about the Comey thing. Yeah, I know. It's, it's like, freaking me out. Yeah. It's all freaking it's me just out. It's fucked up. Right? Yeah. Um, so I thought, what better thing to do than play a little game? A little uh, game. A little, a little, uh, you know, psychological <laughs> twisted game. Would you like to play a game? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. I'm, get, I'm getting, I'm getting in the groove. I think I know where oh we're going with this. I wonder if, if, if one of the challenges is that I have to rip off your arm and, 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 and shovel through your malleable flesh to get a key that unlocks handcuffs, I'm ready. I've, ready? Been, I've been training for this. For this moment, right here. Ready. Oh, PS. But it's got to be your arm so that you can watch me do it. If you, oh, that's You'll still so be conscious true. enough that's to see good. it. That's You'll good. have flashbacks. Good. Is that going to be Let me... <laughs> um, If you like this shirt, yeah, you can head over to twoguysraging.com, our website, just actually type in two guys raging dot com slash swag. 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 I Obviously. literally I did that and I was like I didn't realize that that was gonna be like the name of the thing, like yeah. the, the link. I just uh, like it was the first thing that I thought of. Um that's okay. but if you go there you can order shirts. And uh, they're like thirteen bucks, uh, just full up front. It costs us like twelve bucks to get them. So like you were profiting a dollar on these shirts, right? Yeah. So like, so it's not exactly killing it. Rolling in the fucking yeah. dough, rolling. <laughs> um, but yeah, support us that way, and you know you get to rep some new swag. So yeah, check those out. Um, okay. Well, oh, what I was thinking is for the thumbnail of this, I'm gonna use that crazy doll from. Uh, Oh, okay. no. Jigsaw? Yeah, Jigsaw. Do <laughs> 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 you want to play a game? <laughs> oh, God, <laughs> right. why? Um, all right, so I have a couple of websites up that have different would you rather questions. Yes. Um, one is a BuzzFeed one, and I didn't like a lot of those questions, so I opened up another one. Oh, this yeah. one is called the only list of would you rather questions you'll ever need. Um, all right, so... We are going to start, well, let's start with an easy one. Okay. Would you rather always be 10 minutes late or always be 20 minutes early? 20 minutes early. Right? That's There's no obvious. fucking way. I can't live my life that way. Yeah. Like, I've always, okay, okay. So, not to pull it off of the topic, not to pull it off of the topic, 
But there's this thing that I wanted to talk about where I'm working in the middle of the day. I'm working mid shifts okay. all week because of Frappuccino Happy Hour. Yeah. Is it's, that literally just an hour? No, it's three hours. Okay, that's right. From three to six. Yeah. Misleading name. <laughs> right. <yeah. laughs> um, but it, this is this is it. Okay, this is what's happening. Is I am not used to working mid shifts anymore because the coffee business is a is a an early birds game, right? Yeah. It's so an early birds game. It's my game. Hmm. So I'm not used to this, and now. I sit around all day because I feel like I don't have enough time to get anything started. Oh, that's the worst. Oh, dude. Oh, oh God, dude. I, hate I am that. like, because I'd rather close. Mm-hmm. I'd rather close than be like this weird yep. mid shift. Because like I, and then and then I'm getting really anxious. So yep. I would much rather be 20 minutes early than 10 minutes late. Yep. Because I want to get up and I want to get started and I want to go do stuff. I want to be done. Yeah. Yep. I, I so I totally agree, and like I have that same thing when I close the building, and it, so it's not as bad. Oh, I'm in oh, but it is, but it is just as bad because I'm like, because like ten o'clock hits, and I'm like, oh god, I've got to go to work. I've got to go to work. Yeah. But I'm like, I'm not going to work. I can't go to work this early. What am I gonna do? I'm gonna look like a weirdo. Right. I'm like so sitting there, like talking to myself. So I have three hours to do what with my life, and like you can't do anything fun really nope. because like you gotta go to work. Yeah. So like I can't go sh- boot Black Tower heroin. I gotta, I gotta <laughs> right. fucking do work. There. That's my plan for yeah. my day off. What am I gonna do on my day off? <laughs> right? All right. Yeah. So I would always rather be early. Oh my like god. Twenty oh. minutes early, not a big deal. Not a big deal to me at all. No, that's like, that, that's, that's like that's perfect. Good. Yeah. That's golden. Yeah. Ten minutes early is usually my standard. Twenty minutes early, I can probably like. Yeah, I could work uh, that yeah. in. Fuck that. Yeah. Would you rather be famous when you are alive and forgotten when you're dead, or unknown when you are alive but famous after you die? Well, I plan on the second. You plan on being famous after your dad? Yeah. How do you plan for that? Oh, well, I mean, that's just my goal. Oh, okay. <laughs> that's just my goal. I'm going to see if, if these podcasts <laughs> will live on forever. Forever. So. Yeah, yeah. People in perpetuity. People will love this. Uh, people in the future, you guys are going to love this shit. Oh, my God. There's going to be a retro movement for YouTube, and everybody's going to be like, fuck yeah. That'd be crazy. Yeah, go into the, the YouTubes. It's like when they tried to bring MySpace back. Do yeah. You remember that? Yeah. Justin Timberlake bought it out. JT. Yeah, bro. JT. And if there was one, that's how you know MySpace is dead. Because if there's one person I believe in and I trust more than anybody in the world, it's JT. He could make it happen, but he didn't make it happen. So that means it's he, brought, he did, however, bring Sexy back. He did bring sex. He can bring anything back. Yeah. So you would rather be famous after your death. Oh, totally. Totally. Oh, the idea of living the life of an icon. Oh, God. I mean, you don't get to live the life, though. Yeah, but that's awesome. Well, that means that I did live the life. Yeah. That means I did live the life. I lived the life properly. And, like, I, I didn't let it go to my head. And then I died and everybody, like, carried on, you know? And, like... Yeah, the, that 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 lasts forever. That's awesome. That's, that's awesome. I would rather. I think I'm right there with you. I would rather be famous after I'm dead, for similar reasons. But I I also don't want to deal with the hassles of fame in my day to day. In your day to day life, yeah. yeah. So like, and I, right, like I've got I've got people chasing me around to take my picture anyway. Yeah, uh, right. Sure, so like sure. paparazzi? Hell no! No 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 no! Oh fuck me. <laughs> um, <laughs> Uh, oh, this is well. This would be an easy one for you. Would you rather never use social media again, or never watch another movie or TV show? Oh, <laughs> okay, all right, yeah. Never ever watch another movie or TV show ever again. I'd be fine. I'd be good. <laughs> Little small snack-sized tidbits of information. Social media. That's my game. That's perfect. Um, I think I would. Probably do the opposite. Yeah, you would do yeah. the opposite. Yeah. You would do the opposite. I could live without social media. Like I like social media a lot, but yeah. I'd rather. Well, it's something. It's something, that, like, it's something that you didn't really like until more recently, right? Like in your in your later years. Yeah, in my later your years. Your golden era. <laughs> <laughs> really coming into my own. Oh again. boy. <laughs> um, would you rather go to jail for four years for okay. something you didn't do, Uh-oh. or get away with something horrible? You did do, but always live in fear of being caught. I live in fear every day. I'm fucking Batman, all right? I, <laughs> four years for something I didn't do, or do something horrible and always live in fear? Yeah. I, I guess 
do something horrible and live in fear. Yeah, like, I don't I mean, like, there's, there's really no threat of being caught. Yeah. Right? Like, you're really not, like, I, ne- like, okay, I understand that in this, in this scenario, the genie waves its magic fingers and, or whatever it does. What is the, what does a genie do? I, genie I, does this, I, boom. <laughs> like that. Okay, so genie's like, boom. And then I forget that I made this decision and all of a sudden I'm living in fear. I understand that. But on the other side of that, I would be like, well, I'm not going to get caught, so that's what I'm going to do. Yeah. And I'd just be in fear, and that's fine. That's yeah. cool. I'd rather live I, in fear. I live, I live in fear day. when I work a mid-shift. I'm anxious all day. So, fucking yeah. It's just like a, a, a never-ending mid-shift. That's um, great. Yeah, I'm right there with you. Like, why, why the fuck would you ever choose the other option of, like... Uh, I didn't do anything, and I had to fucking go to prison. Yeah, no, lose, lose. Like, like, yeah, yeah. Like, what do I get to do? Yeah, rehired Comey. <laughs> That's great. Yeah, Ooh. let's do it. Ooh, the second one. Would you rather be completely invisible for one day, or be able to fly for one day? Oh boy. Oh boy. Um, invisible or fly? Now this is okay, but here's the question. Here's the real question, right? I'm invisible. But do physics still work? Because people can hear me. I think physics still works. Okay, you're, you're, not, uh, you're not a panther. All well, you time. say you well, you say <laughs> physics work, but I'm also flying well, in the other scenario. Yeah. So physics really okay. So it's a gravity free world. I'm invisible. Well, I'm not flying. gravity free. And gravity only. You get to ignore I, gravity. I I ignore gravity yeah. forever. Well, well in that yeah. oh, damn. Okay. 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 Twenty four hours invisible or flying. Um. Somebody made this really good point, and I don't know who it was. I think it was on the Game Over Greggy show. They talked about flying, and they talked about how cold and uncomfortable it would be. Oh, to yeah, fly that high up, like, and, like, I think. Ha- fly at a certain speed. Yeah. It would hurt. And then, depending on how your, how your ability really works, like, it would take so much energy. You would be exhausted. It would be like running full sprint. Yeah. So I'd rather be invisible. Also, I'm very I I like I, I like the idea of being able to spy on people. <laughs> and yeah, listen to their conversation. You're a fucking boy or something. Oh yeah. Fuck that. yeah, man. Like, I, Plus I, like imagine if you're flying and then like well, I know our our government's in shambles right now, but imagine a world <laughs> imagine this bizarro world where the where the government's not in shambles. <laughs> and the military <laughs> Shoot you down, dude! They pick you up, yeah, because you're not Superman. You can fly, but like bullets still gonna take you out. Uh, yeah, they fucking um, take me out immediately. I, I have this distinct memory of VidCon from last year when you and I, like, we were both hangry. We're walking out of VidCon, and there's this girl who was crying. Do you remember this? Like, we walked by her, and you were like. Gosh, I wonder what's wrong with her. And I yes. like, I couldn't give a fuck what's wrong with her. Like, all I want to do is eat. Well, and then, yes. That, to me, like, is why you'd want to be invisible. Because you'd love to have just experienced all that and not upset the situation. No, no. But just like, like not, not pride or anything. Yeah, yeah. But, like, then gone back, like, the next day when I'm not invisible. Yeah. And I'm like, hey, hey. I saw, like, <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh-huh. As far as with me, I would rather be able to fly. <laughs> but yeah. Or I would like the you'd invisibility. Be like, you'd be like, hey, bitch, you yeah. want to go somewhere where you're not crying? <laughs> Let's fly. Why? I've, I've used the invisibility so that that girl doesn't look at me and be like, hey, could, do you have five minutes? No, I don't. <laughs> yes. I don't have five minutes. Not even a little bit. I got to You know what? God, I'm invisible. Some, something that I've realized about myself is I surround myself with people who are not socially inept, because you're not socially inept, but like socially um, opposed. Socially yeah. opposed. That's what we'll call them. <laughs> Not socially <laughs> challenged. Socially opposed. And so I feel like I'm. Ju- I just live this life where I just. I'm. I'm the only social butterfly that I know. Yeah. And I. And it, it it's crazy true. to me. Like, like I'm social, but in a very different yes, way. Yes. Yeah, exactly. In a very different. You. Way. You. You have. You have social magnetism and things like that that actually get a, get in the way of your. Yeah, they social get way of, they get in the way of me not wanting. <laughs> yeah, but yeah, I don't give a fuck. Yeah. yeah, that's great. Yeah, you know, nothing I love more is than when we get to do our podcast vacation thing. Yeah, and I wake up, I go to the gym, I come home, I make some coffee, I sit mm-hmm. down in front of my computer, yeah. I start doing stuff. Like I feel so fulfilled, and like I genuinely want to do that. Yeah. That it wouldn't ever. That's really not work. If yeah. that's if that's my dream job, and that's what I'm getting. If, for. If, the, if the worst thing that happened in my day was we talked about logos that we yeah. both didn't like. Yeah. 
Cool. Wait, wait, so which? Like, oh, speaking of which, this. Oh, cut. cut. Okay. So, so like that's the one that I like. I yes. where I cut it out. Is yes. that a little bit better? Do you think? Yes. Okay. Okay. Yes, that's a little bit more like what I'm thinking. But what I was kind of thinking was making the TGRG a little bit bigger, making these guys a little bit smaller. Okay. Um, and I was thinking about two concepts: either doing that or um, one guy over here, one guy over here. Oh, okay. So I, I, I'm not exactly sure what what it's gonna look like, but I think I still have the Illustrator file too. Oh, that would be so, that would be perfect. That's what's tough for me is I have to I don't have an Illustrator yeah, file, you just so have I have to, to pull them from things. Yeah, to make yeah. them work. Oh, yeah, I kind of like that. Yeah. Okay. Um. Anyway. Hopefully, I remember to come back to that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> right. if, if not. We were just looking at what is going to be our business card. We're just last year we went to VidCon and we didn't have fucking business cards. We're going to have business cards Terrible this time. Idea. Terrible um, idea. Terrible. And and I do love. I like the back. I but do. I, too. I wanted. I do want to change the font though. Yes. I want to change that. Font. And then this this needs to be two guys with raging goals needs to be separated because that's how you find us on yes. Facebook. Yep. Good call. Yes. Good call. Um, and yeah, when I looked at this, I was like, I, I I come to the same conclusion as you. Like I I like that it's clean, but it is. Like not memorable. At all. It's very. It's what it. What it, it reminds me of like '90s design. Yeah. Well, hello. I know. I know. '90s. Baby. I know. I know. But With it's choker. But it's me. very like not timely for, for yeah. going to VidCon. Yeah. No. And talking and I, to people who are like, on the internet. That's way more dynamic. Yes. Yes. I yes. hand that to someone. They yeah. they don't give a fuck what's on the back or anything. Right. And then when they go to our page, they're gonna see that logo. They're gonna know that those yeah. are two married yeah. ideas. Right. Yeah. Um. Okay. Back to would you rather. Um. Oh, and just yeah. For the I, I answered that. Yeah, I would do the same thing. I would rather work till I'm dead. At oh my yeah, favorite job. Um. Would you rather find true love or a suitcase with five million dollars inside? Uh. Hmm. <laughs> <laughs> what? I mean. Uh, <laughs> People say money what? don't buy happiness, but they ain't seen money buy happiness. So, yeah, right. <laughs> um, I think I would. Okay. So once again, can we take that wheel out? That <laughs> mouse is just getting bumped. <laughs> I know. A little, a little Mickey over there. Um, but okay. So this is this is. See, I I. The, the real question is, do you believe in true love? Yeah, that, yes. You and know, I, see, we need and a third person on this podcast because we think way too similar. I like, know, I know. So I don't, I, I don't know that I do really believe in true love, which yeah. is odd for me, right? Because yeah. I'm a romantic, I'm yeah. that kind of touchy-feely kind of person, right? Yeah. But I don't, I, I, I believe that people kind of shuffle through life and they find their partner throughout that. And I don't know necessarily that that's true love. I think that it's, kind of a cohabitation there is a love element there but like I love people in general yeah. so like I don't know that there's like a truest of true loves yeah I agree with that I think I think the idea of like soulmates and true love like is something as I get older like I don't buy into like I yes. think you find someone you're compatible with and you guys work really hard to make it work. Yeah. Like and you that, and you and you find and you find the love in that. Yeah. Right? Like you yeah. find you 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 shuffle through that it, that that time period yeah. and you find the love. So I'm taking so, the suitcase. Yeah. I'm, 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 I'm taking absolutely. the suitcase. Yeah, I'll make yeah. it work. Don't maybe maybe we're maybe we're just really trying to argue for the suitcase. <laughs> yeah. That's probably, five million dollars, I mean Yeah. You turn on turn on turn on the turn on the camera next episode, we might say true love's a real thing. Yeah. Yeah. I mean, after I have five million dollars, I might find true love. <laughs> yeah, right. I would truly love <laughs> yeah. that money. I would truly That'd love that money. Yeah. Um, speaking of which, Hawaii next year. Why? You're going to Hawaii for sure. That's awesome. Um, Rod and Katie are doing a uh, uh, like Costco package trip. Like Costco does oh, like, yeah. those, like yeah. all inclusive. I've heard about that. Yes, yes. So I'm going. Yeah. That's fucking awesome. awesome. Katie said, who's going to watch the kids? And I said, somebody fucking else. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I'm going to Hawaii. Duh. Drunk. <laughs> um, ooh, okay, we're going to go back to these because I like this one better. Would you rather be feared by all or loved by all? Loved by all. Loved yeah. by all. Yeah, yeah. me too. Yeah, yeah I mean, like, at, like, at the end of the day. Yeah. 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 Like, I think... Well, and that, that kind of... I don't know. Like, 
I, I like the idea of being loved by all, and then when you snap, people are like, whoa, what the fuck? Yeah. Yeah, like, yeah. what's going on? You're, I, you're much more Im- impactful than I, exp- right? I said that to someone the other day. Nobody like, loved the trench bowl, that's why she lost, right? Yeah. <laughs> Otherwise, we'd all be in the pokey if she was just real calm and, and sedentary, and then all of a sudden she was like, listen, bitch, I'm going to put you in a closet full of nails. You can't, yeah, you can't use... Um, you can't rule through fear. Like, no. uh, the, I forget where I even got this from, but it's some movie or comic book or something where, like, um, Matilda. Yeah. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Roald Dahl. Um, dictators fear their, like, the people they oppress because one day someone will rise up and get yeah. out of the fear and fight them and whatever. Yes. Um, I, it might be V for Vendetta. Um, but anyway. Oh, yeah. Um, yeah, I actually have a little story about that. Um, uh, so a peer of mine, I emailed, I, I got a chance to work with them um, uh, a few weeks ago, right? And spent just a few days working with them. Emailed them uh, when I got back to my store and said, hey, I just wanted to let you know, like, um, I know we didn't have that many interactions, but really appreciated you. Just thought the world of you, the way you carry yourself, the way you talk with your team, the way you handle your business. Like, you, you really kick ass. Forgot I even sent that email. Yeah. Didn't even fucking think about it again. Right. Just whatever. Yesterday, get an email back from this girl, and she was like, I just want you to know I've started this email like 20 times, and I couldn't find the words, and like, I looked at this email a billion times, like, and it's just very encouraging and whatnot, and like, she just genuinely appreciated that I had reached out to her, and it was just funny to me, because I was like, I think I'm probably, I'm known for leading with some emotion, but yeah. it's, it's like you said, like genuinely or generally, if people like you and then you do turn it to a little like where you have some passion about something or like yeah. you get a little stern about something, people are like, oh, shit. Yeah. OK. Fuck, yeah. But now this is real. This is a real thing. And they, I got to be on. This. Yes. They, they yeah. hear it more. Yeah. You yeah. know what I mean? Yeah. yeah. And I, I, uh, I was explaining that too to somebody the other day that I was like, well, yeah, but I use my I was like, I use my temper or my. Like I, I try to. Like I'm, I'm not as good as I want to be, but like I try to use that, like to, I use it intentionally. And if you yeah. use it intentionally, well, and that's something that, do that, yeah, and that's something that you've learned this last yeah. half of your career yeah, that instead you've been of, in, right? yeah, like, instead of being feared all the and time, and just being like that all the time. Yeah. I tell people, because I tell people, cares, like, yeah, 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 like, like when I, when I, when I first started at Kroger, that's who I was. I was angry. I was mean. I was whatever. And then even kind of it's a target you were a little receiver. bit. Hey, yeah, 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 I yeah. are angry people. Oh, they are. Just they are. Honest. You fucking piss them <laughs> off, man. But then, like, then, then I went to Target and I started softening up a little bit. But even then, near the end, like, that's who I was. And then now I feel like I've kind of come into my own and yeah. kind of really realized that I've got to take a step back and I look through, I look at things empathetically instead yeah. of sympathetically or emotionally. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, would you rather be able to teleport anywhere or be able to read minds? Read minds. Really? Yeah, this is just like the invisible thing. <laughs> totally, totally. totally. Like, yeah, lawyer. Yeah, lawyer. <laughs> yeah. Um, that's a tough one for me. I don't know. Like, I always like whenever like when I was a kid and we talked about like, oh, what, what you know, superpowers would you want? I always wanted either like um, telepathy or um, telekinesis, one or the other. Like, yeah, something like that. I wanted to be Jean Grey. Yeah, oh, like, yeah. Fucking be able to do both. Um, but teleporting, like. There are so many, like, and maybe it's just because I travel so much. So much. Like, I'm, yeah. I'm here every other week, right? Yeah. I fucking, every other weekend, I'm at, at Rod's, and then, like, with Target, and I was like, fucking, it would be so nice if I could just, like, in then Pennsylvania, if I just, oh, like. Oh, my gosh. Yeah, I think I'm going to come out for the day. Hey, what's going on, guys? <laughs> yeah, right, yeah. What up, guys? I'm here. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah, I could, um, I, could, I could see that. Yeah. That, that would be really convenient. Yes, I would love the convenience of I would that. love I, the power of yeah, reading yeah. minds. Yeah, yeah. I think you get further with yeah. reading minds, probably. Oh, not, totally. not distance-wise, because, like, physically, I'm going to go further. Than right, that. yeah. I'll go so far away, you can't read my mind. <laughs> <laughs> you, you ain't got cerebro. Yeah, right, 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 right. right. Um, uh, d- 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 that one's stupid. Would you rather die in 20 years of no regrets or die in 50 years of many regrets? Fuck Why the fuck would you want to live 50 years? Yeah, if, right. you, if you could live a perfect 20, why yeah, right. fucking... <laughs> No, I want to live 50 and hate everyone. Yeah, why, yeah, why are you? <laughs> yeah. Uh, oh, this one. Would you rather never be able to use a touch screen or never be able to use a keyboard and mouse? Ooh. Which one? Okay. 
That's interesting. Would I never, I would never be able to use a touch screen or never be able to use a keyboard and mouse. What about a trackpad? Is that I'm going to say that that probably that counts as a keyboard. Is that a keyboard? Okay, yeah. keyboard and mouse. Because, like, the trackpad is attached. To I, the well, I... I mean, you can get a trackpad, but... Like, yeah, I'm gonna, <laughs> um, I guess... I guess the... Re- I guess I would never... I could... I would never... I wouldn't be able to do my job if I couldn't use a keyboard and mouse. Yeah. So, I guess I would have to give up using a screen, a touch screen... But I, I, I couldn't I couldn't really do my job. Are you gonna get a flip phone? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> let's do it. Let's throw it back old school, man. The kids watching this episode in the future, they, they all they know about the retro movement. They know the people of the future. They've spoken. I have to maybe go in at four a.m. tomorrow. God damn, that sounds awesome. You know what also sounds great is I'm off tomorrow. Two days off in a row, mid happy hour. Oh yeah, that's <sighs> wonderful. God, um, I would definitely go the other way. Like, and and so this is what like I hate not having a keyboard and mouse when I'm editing. Yeah, like that's the only way to do it. Yeah. Um, the touch screen is nice, but it's just not as good. Yeah. Um, but my phone, like. Yeah, I'm never gonna go. Like, what am I gonna fucking go back to a Motorola and? Oh, that'd be awesome! Get a sidekick. Yeah, I'm gonna. Fucking... <laughs> yeah, it's too cool. Yeah, sidekick no, three. No, I couldn't do it. Yeah, yeah. Get one of those. What the fuck were those first ones that that you could game onto? I forget what the fuck those were called, but it was like the sidekick. Yeah. Essentially. Yeah. yeah. No, no, uh, I can't do it. I yeah. can't fucking I don't do think, it. I don't think I. I don't. I don't think I can do that. And like, this works. Is I can. I can figure it out. I can. This right here. Fucking, I don't need this piece. Like, I yeah, can yeah. go if I have to. I couldn't fucking edit very well, but, like, I'd get over that. You'd figure it out. Yeah, I'd figure it out, yeah. I got this clicky pen here. I, me, this I don't know what it's that. That's all I don't I know what it's going to do, yeah. but it'll do something for me. Um, yeah, that's terrible. Um, uh-oh, I lost where we were. Oh, that's the one I wanted to ask. Would you rather be able to control fire or water? And I have one follow-up question that needs answered before I can answer that question. What's the question? Can I produce it? Mm. Not that that right, really like, Not like pyro. It. Yeah, yeah. I, mean, like, I don't need a flame sword. Yeah, like, I don't want to carry around a Zippo all my life. Because, like, if, it's, if that's the case, then water all day, because water is everywhere. You got water inside you. Yeah, I'll fucking rip that shit out and use it. Bloodbender. Yeah, bloodbender. That's, that's, that's like, yeah. Exactly. Yeah. yeah. Uh huh. Yeah. Um, I would. This is what I would rather do. I would rather control water so that I could make a bubble around someone's head and watch them suffocate and drown before my very eyes. <laughs> <laughs> Because because then they would have to they would suffer long enough that I could really watch them in agonizing pain and there's no real <laughs> that's be crazy and there's really no promise of that if I'm just burning you to death yeah but I mean I and I gotta smell you smell like cooked bacon which is a great smell but I can't have bacon um I. <laughs> Psychopath aside, I think I would probably, if I could produce it, I want to do fire. Okay. Because I fucking love fire. Yeah, <laughs> I yeah. love fire. And like, since I was a little kid, all I had to do is be able to go, whoa, fucking set things on fire when I want to and just fucking, yeah. Yeah, yeah, I, I so, think would be cool. So yeah, I, I think I'd go with fire. I would also then get really, really fucking good at it because you know how I am, like, when yeah. I focus on something, I'm going after. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'd be able to make like fire whips and shit. Uh, like, yeah, <laughs> and like fire sword, and then like and a shield. Okay, and, yeah, like, and then just be, like fire. Yeah, and, and then it'd just be flame on, and then fucking <laughs> like, fly. Yeah, yeah. So if I could create the fire, I would totally like the fire <laughs> rises, motherfucker. <laughs> oh my fire God. rises. <laughs> yes. All right, all right. Um, I'm gonna do one more before we end this one. Okay. It's um, got to be a really, really good one. Well, I mean, I'm picking it right now, so, like, the fuck? 
Would you rather sell all your possessions or sell one of your organs? That's uh, fucking what? crazy. It's why? Uh, there's this. There's this one that was on. Okay, so from when I was I was a smoker, and I would sit on my back porch and I would smoke. And there was a would you rather? Yeah. A box. And the one on the outside of the box, like, because it gave you, like, sample questions that were inside, one of the questions it asked is, would you rather have a body that never aged with a face that did, oh. or a face that never aged with a body that aged? Oh, that's hateful. Which would you rather have? <laughs> Probably the body not aged. The body not aged? Yeah. In your, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, that's, I mean, that's yeah. a logical choice, right? Yeah, because, like, then, like, I could be old as shit, but I'm still going to be doing shit. Right, yeah, yeah. I'm out fucking, like... Yeah. I don't care how pretty this is if I'm fucking... Yeah. Like, if, uh, <laughs> if, like, I'm just a glass head. <laughs> like, I'm just a like, head in a jar. Yeah, that'd point. be great. Like, that'd be perfect. Phenomenal. He, is, he looks the same age. Well, he lost all of his body because, like, it eventually just turned into fluids. <laughs> but, like... <laughs> Beautiful face. Yeah, just right. Hold it together. <laughs> and then it's not to shave every day. Like, yeah, yeah fuck it. Uh, just get old. Yeah. yeah. Let my face. Plus a little, little gray. A little gray. Yeah. Boom. Yeah. I'm getting that. Yeah. I'm getting there. I'm going through there. I'm going through oh here. Yeah. Yeah. All right. I found one. Okay. Perfect. Would you rather know when you're going to die no. or how you are going to die? You can't change the time or method of your death. Like, it's inevitable. Right. It's not. This yes. is what's yes. going to happen. Yes. Would you rather know when you are going to die or how yeah. you are going to die? I would rather... Can you imagine? <laughs> oh, uh, oh, boy. Um, I would rather... Ooh. Ooh. I would not want to know how. I would not want to know how. Yeah. Yeah, so so my argument for this is I would rather know And I would I would actually rather not when when it comes to knowing when, I would rather not know the day. Like I would rather want to I would want to know the year. I don't want to know any of it. I wouldn't I, but but like imagine this. You're in a situation where you know down to the very I got to make sure this person don't fuck with my car. You know down to the very second that you're going to die. Oh, yeah. You're always counting down to that yeah. second. Yeah, it would be terrible. But if you didn't know the year, then you could make that last year, like, your shit. Yeah. Right? I right. Mean, or the year you before, or whatever. Yeah, yeah, you don't die on January 1st, because that would be a real bitch. Right, right. Um, yeah, so my... I'm with you. I would rather know when, not how. Yeah. And my argument for that is, if you are going to die in 2020 in a car accident but you don't know it's 2020, you just know it's a car accident, that's how you die, you're never going to get in a fucking car the rest of your life. Right. Like, maybe you don't die until you're 100 in a car accident, but you're like, and no, then, not, and then, and then not death, doing it. And then death is just hunting you down. Yeah, and like, it's also self-fulfilling. So like, in my example, if you're not going to die until you're in a car, then you're not going to get in a car for as m much as fucking possible until this one time comes up and it's like, and you have there is no other option and then you get in the car and that's when you die. And it's like, well, yeah, that's right. self-fulfilling. You, you were in a car for yes. the last seven years. So like the odds of you dying in a car accident then were not very good, but you know, <laughs> here it is. Yeah, yeah. exactly, exactly. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I'd yeah, much no. rather know what. And every time, yeah, so like you would start avoiding things like you're, you're gonna die of an animal mauling. I'd be like, well, I'm never going to the zoo. Never. <laughs> fuck, fuck the zoo. Fuck this fucking mouse over here that's gonna fuck shit. Like the dog downstairs. Yeah, uh, None uh, of it. No. I can't handle it. No. Not happening. No. Um, wouldn't it be crazy though if like you, you could get that answer and like the question, what are you looking at? I'm just thinking about uh, that. I'm just what if, really what freaked if, like, out by answer, it. Like, you know, we're asking the genie or whatever and like it tells you how you're gonna die and it says like, by vampire. <laughs> Wouldn't that be fucked up? Like, I'm sorry, I have a few more questions. Could you come back? <laughs> I have just and then like, he just, yeah. I have like three or four more questions. Like, um, <laughs> first off. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. But the or, genie was like, have you ever seen Jurassic Park? Yeah. And then he was like, wait, yes. Yeah, okay, wait, 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 wait. More, more, more. <laughs> T-Rex. <laughs> I'm sorry, what? <laughs> Better than oh, raptors. My God. Um, or if like, they were like, uh, you actually die in the 21st Hunger Games and then just left and it was like 
When did the <laughs> when's the first one? When do they start? Yeah. <laughs> when do they start? The, when did like when did come back? <laughs> <laughs> Fuck me. Okay, yeah. this was fun. I yeah, like that. Was, that was great. Guys, thank you again for tuning in to Two Guys with Raging Goals. Again, I'm Mikey. This is Adam. We bring you a podcast every Friday. You can follow along with us. We sometimes play fucking games. Other times we just talk about crazy shit. I got two people to sign up for our podcast uh, at the gym the other day. Oh. That, uh, my one buddy was there and we were talking and I was like, oh yeah, no. He asked what was new and I was like, oh, I just booked my trip to California and he was like, oh, what do you do that for? And I was like, oh, for my podcast thing. And he's like, oh, that's right. Yeah, I forgot you do that. Someone overheard and was like, what podcast do you do? Oh. I was like, Really? Oh, we do like a nerdy, it's like a YouTube thing. And he was like, oh, that's cool. What's it called? And I was like, two guys with raging goals. Don't set the bar too high. Like, I don't want you to like, <laughs> yeah, I, I really enjoy it. But like, I don't want you to yeah, like, I don't know if you're going to yeah, like, yeah, yeah, like, I don't know. Yeah. 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 And he was like, no, that's totally cool. I'll check it out. Fucking signed up. I was like, hey, all right. That's hey, awesome. Do you like Patreon? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah. How do you feel about Patreon? Yeah, yeah. How do you feel about that? <laughs> Um, so thank you so much, you guys, for supporting us. Um, we had our first video hit a thousand views. Yeah, fucking That's insane. Fucking awesome. Harry Potter, motherfucker. <laughs> Everybody loves they Harry love Potter. It. They love. They love. Thank you so much, you guys, and we will catch you on the next one. Ah, uh, every time. <sighs>